quarters match beginning. We see Steve once again from Roiling. That's our man versus Vexiel's Mewtwo. Oh, I mean, this Steve has conquered some pretty big threats. Can it conquer the Mewtwo? Yeah, we'll, we'll have to see. I mean, thing is with Mewtwo, he can kind of press you with like the small Shadow Balls, so it might be hard for uh, for Steve to kind of get the, oh, sorry, for Roiling to get the crafting that he needs to do. And I, but I can also, I could also see, uh, see Roiling getting some absurdly early kills against this character. Yeah, like, that was something I was um, thinking about, especially versus light characters. Yeah. Like, you need to go and get those diamonds as quickly as you possibly can. And as you can see, he's setting up those walls, trying to find that space. But Vexiel really doing a great job of getting in there and getting the, like, every single hit. Just look at this pressure he's putting on. Mm. Yeah, another back air. Like, Roiling has had absolutely no time to mine or gain any tools. He's basically just got dirt and wood. Um, now, Small Battlefield does have a uh, a set, like, you know, ratio for uh, yeah, dirt like... to wood and stuff like that. So you yeah. will get some decent materials, but right. now look at that. Like, Vexiel has just taken such a commanding lead. Oh. <laughs> and it's all because he really hasn't been able to mine and uh, get a lot of his stuff started. Yeah, I mean, I think the play might be just go to the platform and start doing it, because what he's doing, he's kind of standing on the ground, and it's so easy for, uh, it's so easy for Mewtwo to just kind of throw little shadow balls at you, but it, at least if you go to a platform and keep alternating between the platform and the floor, you might be able to, uh, like, just stay out of his range a little bit, but instead he's kind of, he, he, uh, he, he was doing this against Days of Twist as well, he would mine for like two seconds, get bored and just run in. Like, you don't really want to be <laughs> doing that. You know, you, you need, you need the uh you need these materials and stuff it's, it's how steve plays there we go he's got a diamond now so he's gonna he's definitely gonna craft a uh, diamond weapon soon we'd assume yeah i think i would save that diamond for now if i was roiling because now that you see the percent that uh vex seal is at like given how light uh mewtwo is like anything will kill uh now and it's all a matter of like trying to find an early kill to bring uh, you know, roiling back into this game because yeah. he's an entire stock down. Yeah, he is. Oh, well, there we go. He's got, he has got the diamond weapons now, though, and like against Mewtwo, this could be fatal. Like, I don't know if you've seen how strong that back air is, but goodness me, bro, it's basically like Arsene, dude. Like, <laughs> oh my goodness, a really, really nice disable though, meaning that he gets a uh, half charged F smash there, mm. and seventy percent on uh, on roiling, and roiling is still Ooh. just continuing to uh, to go in here. Yeah. He really likes going in. He's a very aggressive player, clearly. Oh, really nice him. teleport. I wonder if we'll see Rolling uh, maybe a character counter pick or if he's dedicated on going zombie today. Nah, I think, you know, uh, zo zombie's a good skin. It's uh, like, it's the lesser used one. I feel like everyone's picking Enderman. I, I'm personally a fan of Scottish Steve. I think that's one of my favorite because he's got see, like a, uh, he's got like a suit on it looks really cool <laughs> i couldn't agree with you more like i'm a massive fan of scottish steve scottish steve is my pick yeah. um because i mean i've got a mook in my last name so like of course i'm gonna love scottish steve like it, that's <laughs> those are those are my boys bro your rolling's kind of going off right now though he's brought this like all the way back yeah that jab forward it's a forward uh, to up smash bro it's kind of busted oh okay this is now a crazy last stock situation. And he's got those diamond tools still, so like, you can oh, see Vexiel. The, the jump read, that was so good. Yeah, Vexiel read that jump from hours ago. Beautiful. Beautiful. Really, really nice stuff from Vexiel. And I feel like if he was like five, six frames too slow there, uh, he would have like eaten a forward air from Steve and this game could have gone in a completely different direction. Yeah, I mean, yeah, all Steve needs to do is like back here. You are like twenty, and you die. Like this, this, <laughs> this uh, character can hit really hard. A, a diamond back air. I mean, diamond back is so strong. Like a lot of people have been comparing him to Arsene back air, and it's not entirely mm -hmm. inaccurate to be honest. And like the forward air as well oh, has like a. Yeah, well, the forward air hitbox as well has like a, a, a spike hitbox as well, right? So it can be really, really hard to get around. And it's so fast too. Like, compare Steve's forward air to Mario's forward air, mm. and there's honestly, like, no comparison. Because it's disjointed, 
has a spike hitbox, and its frame data is like absolutely ridiculous. Oh my god, we're seeing a hero. We're seeing hero. Okay, hero, is, hero, yeah, hero. Okay. What? Um, honestly, this is exciting as well. I love watching hero. He's so funny. He's definitely like one of the highest banter level characters. Okay, so we're going to see uh, maybe a little bit of camping again from Roiling, but for completely different reasons, looking for those spells, of course, in Hero's repertoire. Um, yeah, no, I mean, Steve uh, wasn't really working out for him, but maybe Hero's a choice here. Near the end, it was st certainly starting to look a little bit better, but I think Roiling still needs to practice just his Steve a little bit, to be fair. I think it's still really impressive, like, how Roiling can play a character that's only been out for, like, a week, and pretty much do a, do a good job at standing toe to toe with Vexil's mate. Yeah, definitely do, was doing a decent job to be fair. We're getting quite low on this MP. He needs to actually hit a move. He keeps going for all the spells and the menus. Oh yeah, that's gonna do it. That I think that was a, a double a double buff forward air actually. I definitely saw the psych up. I'm not so sure about the uh, oomph though. I'm pretty sure he got oomph as well, but oh, that's an unfortunate uh, missed F smash there. But of course, if you have psych up and oomph, you cannot shield forward air or back air because you will have your shield broken immediately. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just one of those stupid things about Hero that Hero can just do for some reason. Yeah, Hero is very pro proficient at just popping your shield for sure. And I mean, look at this, like, it's doing a lot better for Roiling here. Now you see a pretty healthy lead, but Vexiel not going to let it, uh, you know, get him down. You can't throw him when game, he's got but... bounced on. Yeah, I forget about that one as well. Uh-oh, kaboom. Oh my god, he reflected it. That looks so That wacky. was actually tedious. That was yeah. the only way he lived that, given yeah. his positioning. Yeah, that was legendary, because... I was going to say, the way that Kaboom was there, I was sure Vexio was dead, but oh dear, is that, that's not going to do it on this stage. Sure. <gasps> what? He was at 67 on Town and City. Um, did what? he have oomph? Because I know oomph makes you take a little bit more knockback. No way. Yeah, I guess it was the rage, but it wasn't even max rage. Max rage is like 160 in this game. There's no way. That, at 67? Holy that moly. Is I don't think he had any buffs. Oh my god, I am... I am no, angry. I'm pretty sure he had at least one. I'm angry. Um, yeah. But no, chat, feel free to correct us if we're wrong here. Mm. But I mean, now that means Vexiel is now, you know, prepared to take a stunning lead here in this game. Yeah, and... I, I genuinely cannot believe that kill. That was insane. <laughs> Mewtwo's ridiculous, man. Yeah, he's People just... do underestimate this character. Yeah, um... that... I'm always saying, right, you don't want this character to be good. Like, when this character's really good, you guys will remember why you will remember. Oh, it's like it's like, uh, it's like like Jigglypuff as well. Like, people are saying, ah, oh, buff Jigglypuff. Do not buff Jigglypuff. <laughs> Please do not buff Jigglypuff. Absolutely not, dude. Like, play, play Melee and tell me that Jigglypuff should be good again. Because you do not want that to happen. Oh, yeah, zoom. really... Oh, almost catching the zoom, though. Almost lucky enough to be there. Yeah, you've li it's literally a gamble. Like the game decides for you whether you're, uh, which way you're going. Oh, he's got the. Is this a psych up or an oomph? Either way, uh, it's I think scary. psych oh. up because it's a little bit yeah, more red. The one. Oh, there you go. That's it. But uh, yeah, that is going to be Vexil taking out Roiling, whether it be with. Um... Oh no, I almost said whether it be with Steve. No, that's Steve. You, Steve. Uh, I'm.